hello beautiful viewers welcome to another smc tutorial and in this video we are going to be talking about coin gecko and now in our previous video we explained all about coin market cap and just like we explained in cmc coin gecko is also a price tracking platform arguably one of the best and also one of the most visited uh coin gecko also tracks price data from so many cryptocurrencies so many exchanges crypto enthusiasts crypto traders crypto investors always look to compare price data analyze and also follow up on their favorite tokens using coin gecko so not to waste no time we are going to get right into this video to get started and to download coin gecko on your mobile device be it an android or an ios device just visit your app store or your google play store when you launch it you type in coin gecko and then you select coin gecko please make sure it has adequate ratings be sure of the correct coin gecko that you are downloading having done that you just click on open now when this opens up it launches the first page of coin gecko for you so on coin gecko's home page you have all the navigation tools that you will need to go around coin gecko platform and um, up there you can see cryptocurrency you can see categories you can see exchanges you can see derivatives you can also see the global market cap you can also see the 24 hours trading volume of all the cryptocurrencies also you can see the top 100 according to their market cap all the way down to 100 so this is very interesting. I love how CoinGecko's grouping is. You can see it neatly done. Down below, you can also see the portfolios. You can see search, you can see explore, and you can see more. So let's get right into it. So the first feature I'll be explaining is the top left bell notification. And if you click this, it's to set price alert. Now, uh, let's say you want to, you know, add a price alert for a token. For example wkc which is wikicat once you select it your target price you can put minus 20 percent minus 10 minus 5 plus 5 plus 10 plus 20 and let's say we want to do plus 20 and um, alert mode once or reoccurring we can set reoccurring and then we save this click on save and then it loads up it says price alert created so if you go back you see that um Wikicat has been set with the price alert notification. So anytime the price changes by 20% every time, it's going to send you an alert. All right, so at the top right, we have the candy jar and the search icon. So if you click on this candy jar, every day you log into CoinGecko, you come here to claim some rewards. And then you can see the reward gets higher every day you log in consecutively. Now, these rewards can be used to, you know, assess a whole lot of things from CoinGecko. Also, you have the search icon. So if you wish to search for your favorite cryptocurrencies, for example, WKC, you just click it in there and then search for it. It brings out the coins profile or the tokens profile for you. And then you just go through it, everything you want to see, ranging from the market cap, trading volume, and all of that. So next we want to explain is the categories. And then this just groups all the cryptocurrencies according to their ecosystem. It also shows you their 24 hour price changes in percentage and also shows you the total market cap in all of these ecosystems so you can see the meme ecosystem you can see it has about 18 billion dollars and has increased by six percent so if you just want to find out more you click on meme and then it opens up all the memes that are listed in meme category on coin gecko so this is very effective the grouping is very very nice also so um if you want to check on exchanges you click on exchanges it ranks them from one to the last and also ranks them according to their reported volume and also their trust score for example the number one is binance and you can see with an 11 billion dollar reported volume and the trust score is 10 over 10 so it's safe to say that the first um 15 or the first 14 are very safe and then anyone from nine eight seven is also safe so do well to you know trade with uh, 
exchanges that have very nice scores and enough trading volume so um you can also go to derivatives you can see it for futures and all of that you see all the exchanges right there so let's head over to the navigation tool down below and uh, let's click on portfolio um i already have my wkc being tracked here just the same way i had it on cmc and then i have um 10 trillion wiki card worth a thousand eight hundred and sixty nine point two two dollars and um, you can see in the last 24 hours it has increased by 3.3 percent which amounts to about plus 57 you can see it up there if you want to add another token you just click on the plus sign up there and let's say i want to add btc you just click on bitcoin and then you allow it to load up for you and then you just go back now when you've added the btc and then you want to put in your values you just click on plus here and then you just click on the quantity you have let's say i have 100 btc uh, and then i submit this you click on submit and you save it so now it will begin to track your portfolio by the total amount of tokens you have and the total amount of all the tokens so you can see and i have 2.1 million dollars because i'm holding 100 btc and 10 trillion wiki cards so you can see how interesting this portfolio is you don't need to be going into all your wallets one after the other it just arranges everything for you here in real time so the next one down below there should be the search uh, it basically does um the same thing the search at the top right does but let's just explain this you have your search history up there and then you have your trending searches so most of the trending searches are those coins or tokens that many coin gecko users have been searching for over time and then um, your search history are the ones that you've searched in a couple of days or a couple of months so um you can just use this feature to search for your favorite coins or tokens and then uh, visit their profiles to get all the info so the next feature is the explore feature and in this explore feature you can see from news you have all crypto news you have learned crypto articles for you to learn you can see it has the authors of this learning articles you have podcasts if you want to listen to some podcasts it has newsletter and it has blog uh, you can see how interesting this explore feature is so if you want to stay informed if you want to learn you can test out the explore feature all right so the next option down there is the more option and here you can see your account you can also see your candies you can toggle on or off your dark mode here you can also see your currency in primary and secondary mode which means if you want to see your your portfolio in usd or btc you can toggle between primary and secondary you can see your language settings if you're not of english speaking and you want to set it to your preferred language you can click on the language and then select from any of the languages available here you can also set your default start screen you can set it to either start on market or start from your portfolio and you also have some tools here tools like the calculator you can use this to calculate like i explained in the coin market cap video also you can see the notifications here um just like we have the bell notification in the home screen and then you have um, all of their social media accounts and their emails you have um, other options here like the privacy policy terms of service and disclaimers and the sign out button so guys this is a brief maneuver or basic navigation for coin gecko price tracking platform so do well to download this and do well to play around and get acquainted with this beautiful price tracking platform so until the next video see you next time